So this morning we're going to Snow's Cut. We're trying to get there before the tide rises and in the, in the, right, the right direction of the current so we can get through the bridge uh, without scraping. We woke up this morning um, without an alarm, around six, and looked at, uh, looked at all of the, the navigation information to see what time it was best to leave, and it was like right now. So when we get to this area right here, shows six feet on both sides of the channel and we have to go right smack in the middle. We have a 5-4 draft. That's six feet, six and a half feet. That's two feet, three, seven. So we're gonna be coming in. We gotta watch really closely in here in this area. And then this, again, one foot, three feet, this is all caution, so we have to stay right in this white area. going against us, that'll slow us down, but it'll give us more control on the, through the boat. Instead of like being in a river like, ah! we actually oppose it, so it's more steerage. So they're starting to turn into the narrow channel here. It's very narrow. And a couple feet that way, it goes down to six feet. Right now we got 16 depth. Going around that green movie. Keep it between the navigation beacons. We uh, ran aground almost. Well, we stopped. We kind of hit, right? Yeah, we hit. Some we hit uh, because the markings aren't very clear here. Um, in the ICW, the buoys are opposite than um, on the ocean. Well, yeah, it's based on your east or west. So we went on the wrong side of the buoy, which put us in six six point seven feet of water. So we shouldn't have hit, but we did. We hit the bottom. Yeah. And Do that once it a while. wasn't so bad. As long as it wasn't. We're going slow. It was mud. It was mud. We went backwards, we got out very quickly, yeah, but it did slow us down a little bit. So hopefully we'll still make it to cook. So it's cut before high tide, I think we will. I'm going this speed, I think we'll be there in about a half hour, which is still on track. Following the channel here, there's the green buoy to the right. The red buoy to the left. Green to the right, the red to the left. So 
I'm coming through it right now. That's where we're gonna head. Right through that narrow channel. See the boat? There's the bridge right there. We're still, I think, about a mile um, left. This is what I talk about when I watch my cat. Now I try to stay in the channel. Just so kind of hug the, try to hug the edges to see what the hell you are. Bounce back and forth. So there's the green, and the red is right there. So we have to turn to the right. So he's going towards the right of it. Really deceiving because that bridge is still a mile away. And it's so close. Wasn't there a movie called The Longest Mile? Yes. Okay, I thought so. Is that what this is? Yes, this is The Longest Mile. Da 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 that's what it feels like. It's like, there it is! We can make it! We can make it. We have to get around these people that are trying to. You know, this us. is kind of windy, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, there's two boats coming towards us. They're both smaller than us. Okay, that works. Draft is not restricted. We are a full displacement hull vessel. So the Coast Guard rags are on verbatim, basically like you follow, the, you, you follow the rules of the road, um, but vessels that are restricted to their navigation um, are out right away. Because we can't go. There is a, a power boat coming behind us. Very, very fast. Uh, roger that. Uh, I can't uh, move too much out of the channel because I have a pretty deep drop, but uh, I'll slow down. I don't see the buoy. What? I don't see one. Oh, I don't think there's one until after the bridge. Okay. Right We're at mid tide. 2.22, it says. So we going through? Yeah. yeah. I guess we've got to at this point. It's easier than going back, maybe. Uh,
we are moored. It was super easy. We came in first time, picked it up with that guy's help. Uh, and we got it done in about five minutes. Super simple, it's a nice quiet place here. Gorgeous. We'll be here for three days. See you next week. Rubber ducky, you're the one. You make that bath time lots of fun. Rubber ducky, I'm awfully fond of you. Bye guys. Thanks for visiting. We go with the flow.